I want to unite the party. And once we have been able to sit down and look at what we want to do for the country, we'll have a very short period of time, about two years, to prepare for a general election campaign. And I guarantee you, if there's one thing I know and I have learned in politics, I know how to win. And I don't, I don't shy away from a fight. This fight is worth it. This is about Canada. And I'm, uh, I'm, going to be, I'm going to be in this to win this fight, and I'll win it for the right reasons. First of all, for the Conservative Party, but I want to win for Canada itself. I've always done very well in Alberta when I was in politics. People, you know one thing that Albertans feel strongly about is that it's not where you're from, and it's not your name, and it's not your diploma, or it's not that determines what your future is. I've always loved that about Albert, Alberta and Albertans. So in this province, I have a lot of people I've worked with over the years who are friends and colleagues who will be there. And it'll be a fight. It'll be a real fight. But you know, what else is new? I, I'm definitely open to supporting uh, John. I like, I like his speech. It was good tonight. I want to wait a little longer, see kind of, you know, some more concrete proposals. But I, I was certainly impressed. It was a good speech. I think it was a fine speech. He really danced around the uh, carbon tax issue, which I thought was interesting because Albertans have very out loud said they are against a carbon tax, and all Conservatives had said they are against a carbon tax. That was one of the main issues that was behind the de the uh, replace O'Toole movement was that he implemented a carbon tax. So if we elect another leader that implements a carbon tax, despite it being in our party's constitution that we don't support one, he's going to be ousted the same way O'Toole was. So he sort of sabotaged his campaign in his opening speech, which I think was an interesting decision. And here's the, here's the question for Charest. He's from Quebec. We assume he's got good support in Quebec. But can he build an alliance? Can he reach out? like Mulroney did in 84, and build a Western Quebec alliance, or like Harper did in building an Ontario Western alliance. I mean, that's the question. Can he do it?